fire dancer and more. Our next guest is truly one of a kind and so talented in every way. And if she looks familiar, it's probably because you've seen her at a lot of different local festivals, blowing everyone out of the water with her skills. We want to welcome Nat Spin. Woo, look at her spin Woo, right in. Look at that. Oh my <laughs> Yay, we're so happy to have you. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you for having me. It's so good to be here. Yes. And good to see you again. We we did hula hooping together. I'm excited to teach you how to yes. hula hooping too. Here, okay? yes. yes. So, you know, you are, have this wonderful name here in the community and yeah. it's such a bright light. Uh, tell us a little bit about how you got into performing all these different tips and tricks. What drew you to the hula hoop or, you know, the fire dancing and all of that? So, when I first started hula hooping, it was because I, I literally just needed something of my own. I'm a mm -hmm. mom yeah. and I was homeschooling my kids and stuff like that and I needed something for me mm -hmm. and in hula hooping I found fitness I found movement meditation I found a community and mm -hmm. friends and a bunch of girl power and stuff so <laughs> awesome. um, yeah and then slowly it became fire and now it's aerialist and circus type thing that this was like an outlet for you especially since you were a mom and you were looking for something for you right but uh, after watching all of your different videos I have to ask you how did you, do you research this before you get started? How do you practice? So, um, it obviously it just starts out with, with hula hoops. You don't mm -hmm. want to jump okay. right into right. the fire right away. Right, right, right. <laughs> um, but uh, you would start out with a bigger hula hoop. Okay. And that's really all you need. You can find a ton of tutorials online by checking on YouTube. Okay. And then also there's a huge hoop dancing community out there as well. We love yes. that. Yeah. What do you think, you know, when you go to these different festivals and you perform, uh, what response do you get and why do you think you get that? Like, it's, it's just so cool to look at, but the oohs and ahs, you know, how does that make you feel? It, well, it makes me feel really good. Mm -hmm. I, I think the best part is teaching people that you can do things like this mm -hmm. with a hula hoop. Because a big part of it is like, when you think of hula hooping, you think about just hula hooping on your waist yeah. and stuff, which is awesome <laughs> on its own. But then you realize you can hula hoop with any part of your body and you can be any experience level mm -hmm. okay. and be able to do cool hula hoop tricks. Yep. Well, speaking of, uh, I think if you said we all can do it, I didn't think you I can. could. But can you show us uh, a little demonstration and show Nicole and I how we should get started? <laughs> yes. I have a in years. Okay? <laughs> yes. So as you can see, I brought a ton of different hula hoops. Mm -hmm. So the reason being is as a general rule of thumb, it, it, let's say you cannot hula hoop around your waist for the life of you, mm -hmm. like I was when I first started out. This is the first hula hoop I ever made for myself. You notice it's okay. so much bigger mm -hmm. than my performance hula hoops that I use. Right, oh, so wow. the bigger yes. when it's, the, it's a little easier. Right, the bigger the hula hoop, the more it hugs you on the way around, and there's more space on the inside, which gives you okay. more time to figure out the rhythm of the oh, hoop. Oh, yeah. okay. So you want to start off with that one? Oh, you want yeah, me to start so I do want to. I brought two beginner hoops. Oh, I didn't okay. know your experience. Right yeah. Okay, so I get one, you get one? Okay. All right, let me put these aside here. Okay, all right, I'm gonna let you go first all right. Right. Of course, Nicole, well, because you. you're going to hit me. Okay. All right, Nat, so why don't you show all me right. to just start. Step number I'll one. I'll go over in the mm -hmm. side right here. Pull the hoop up against your back. You guys with me so far? Okay. Awesome, okay. awesome. Right. Step right. number two, this is where we lose people, okay. is you want to make sure you have Ooh, a fast, here. flat spin. Okay. You're going to spin it nice and flat and fast. We're not going to worry about the waist yet. Go ahead and give it a big okay. spin. You're, you're going to move up a little I'm bit, girlfriend. There we go. Okay. There you go. Okay. There you go. See, you got it. You want to mm -hmm. keep your back straight, mm -hmm. and then it's just going to be a line with your hips. So you're either going to go side to side mm -hmm. in a line, I'm just or you can go front to go back. Ahead. Go ahead, Nicole. Oh. <laughs> hula hoop okay. battle. We're hula hoop battle. All right, so while we hula yep, yep, this is not very good. Um, so, But we are going to see you kind of perform oh, yes. outside with your LED hula hoop. We're super fo looking forward to looking at that. In the meantime, in the commercial break, I am going to work a little bit better right. on this. Yeah, you don't want anybody to see you lose because that you won yesterday. I don't know what you're talking about, but we're heading outside <laughs> for Mother Patty to stay with us. Yeah. <laughs>